My name is Patty Bobrick and I'm a physical therapist here at the MS Comprehensive Care Center in Orlando, Florida, a part of Orlando Health. And I'm going to talk to you about rehab intervention for MS. If you're living with MS, uh, you know that there are many challenges that you're faced with. There is the unpredictability and uncertainty of the disease. So you're faced with uh, coping with changes. Uh, your disease is not like anybody else's disease and your own symptoms may vary month to month, week to week, day to day, and even within a day. So you're constantly faced with uh, possibilities of difficulties doing your activities of daily living and your work and leisure activities, caring for your family. All of those things can be affected by your symptoms. So, uh, rehab can be an important part in your overall comprehensive plan for your MS. Uh, I believe that your rehab team should be on the scene very early on in the disease, even in the absence of a lot of disability and a lot of symptoms. Uh, physical therapy, occupational therapy, speech therapy are all members of the rehab team. Physical therapy can help evaluate your muscle strength, your balance, your flexibility, and your mobility, your walking, getting up and down from the floor, up and down stairs. The occupational therapist can assess your fine motor skills and your activities of daily living. How are you getting in and out of the shower? How are you managing to cook your meals? Are you able to do your laundry? And a variety of other things, including uh, leisure activities and working and driving. Your speech pathologist can evaluate your speech, your volume, do you slur your words, are you having a hard time being heard at the end of the day, and also can evaluate you for swallowing issues. Uh, both occupational therapy and speech therapy can look at cognition, your thinking skills, your memory, which can also be affected in MS. So. Uh, the members of your rehab team may come in and out depending on where you're at in your disease process. But you want to speak to your physician early on about the benefits of, of anyone in, on the rehab team and how they might be able to help you. You may also need to see your rehab professionals if you've had an exacerbation. So if there's been a change in your functional status, uh, we want to see you in therapy so that we can help regain all of the functional skills that you're able to. You may be later on in the disease where you're not having exacerbations, but you might be having some progression. We're able to help evaluate you and be able to see changes that happen year to year and problem solve, offer adaptations to what, how you're doing things and strategies to live better. Overall, your entire rehab team is looking for you to live well, healthy, and independent no matter where you are in the disease.